Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to install and use Jupyter Notebook from scratch. Whether you are a beginner in Python or starting with data science, this guide will help you get up and running in no time. Let's get started. Jupyter Notebook is an interactive web-based coding environment where you can write and execute Python code in a structured way. It's widely used in data science and machine learning, Python programming and scripting, and visualization and exploratory data analysis. Jupyter lets you mix code, text, and visualizations in a single document, making it perfect for learning and research. So let us install Jupyter Notebooks. Uh, for installing Jupyter Notebooks on your systems, you have two main options. The first option is installing via yeah, Anaconda, that is recommended for beginners. And the second option is installing via PIP, that is for advanced users, only if you have Python already installed in your system. So the first option of installing Jupyter Notebook on our system is installing via Anaconda, and this is recommended for beginners. So Anaconda is basically a Python distribution that comes preloaded with Jupyter Notebook and many useful libraries. So for that, we first need to go to anaconda.com. We need to provide our email address to download the distribution. Then they'll provide us the download uh, link in our email. Provided the uh, Anaconda distribution download link. Now we need to click on download now. And then we can choose which operating system we are on, whether we are on Windows, Mac or Linux. So since my system is Windows, I need to click on this. So it will download Python 3.12 version. Loading uh, Anaconda into our systems, we need to open the Anaconda Navigator and we need to scroll down. So over here we'll find the Jupyter Notebook and we need to click on launch. Now let us see the second option of installing Jupyter via pip and this is for advanced users. So if you already have python installed then you can go to the command prompt and simply run pip install Jupyter. see that uh, Jupyter has been installed in my system now what we need to do is we need to uh, launch the Jupyter notebook and we okay so they have launched the Jupyter notebook now we need to create a new notebook from over here we need to create a python 3 iPod I by kernel notebook okay so this is our Jupyter notebook now let me show you how to run your first Python code in a Jupyter notebook so first what you can do is you can rename the notebook by clicking over here on this untitled you can rename the file let me write it as Jupyter demo then so Jupyter notebooks are made up of cells. So this is one cell and we need and if you want to run our Python pro code, then we need to write the code inside these cells and then we can run them easily. So let me start with the very basic print statement print hello world. So now let me run this. Yeah, so this is the output and we can also run this command with shift plus enter. Yes. So in the next video, I'll talk about more such Jupyter shortcuts. So as you can see that it is very easy to run a Python code in Jupyter. So that's it guys. You have successfully installed Jupyter Notebook and run your first Python code in Jupyter. In the next video, I'll show you some advanced Jupyter Notebook tricks to boost productivity. If you have found this video helpful, don't forget to like, to, like this video, subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends.